Hello, this is Jared from Commit Quality. In today's video, I'm going to show you how we can perform file uploads in Cypress. Before we get started, just want to talk about the test page we're using. So it's part of commitquality.com forward slash practice hyphen file hyphen upload, or you can go from practice and find the file upload section, click on it, and you'll be taken to this page. So my example, I've just chosen dummy files, three text, hit submit, and you'll see that this dialog box appears saying file successfully uploaded. And that's exactly what we want to test is making sure that 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 has appeared. So let's jump right into the actual Cypress code. So first thing we want to do is perform a visit to that page. So let's just say sci.visit and we're going to take the URL here and paste it in. Next then what I want to do is actually select the file that we want to upload. And to do that, we're going to say sci.get It's going to be an input format of type files we'll say type equals file and you can check that by if we go here inspect the choose file option you can see input here and it's got a type of file this is what we'd expect if you're doing a kind of file upload section but you can double check it from the dom itself then what we want to do is say select the file so cypress has a select file method so i can say dot select file and you can see exactly here, these are the file or files to select or drag onto this element. So what I want to do is I have a dummy text file inside my fixtures here, which is example txt. I'm going to copy the relative path. I'm going to paste it in here. And of course, we can do forward slash forward slash there. So we say in a key, take the file from Cypress which is my project inside the fixtures folder and the example.txt inside there. And that should drag and drop it onto there so it performs the file upload. But we still have to, if you remember, click this submit button. So we'll do that next. We'll say side.get. Of course, it's a button. And it should have a type again on it. So I'll say type equals, and I believe the type will be submit. Let's just double check that. We'll go over to this and we can see type equals submit. All good there. And of course, we want to perform an action, which is going to be the click. So I'm going to say dot click. Perfect. So in this case, then what should happen is it should upload the file and click submit. Let's actually run this and see what happens. Because we are missing a key part of this. And I want to show you it before adding the code in so you understand why we're adding it. So if I go into the example, you can see here, file upload. Oh, it doesn't like our assertions. Input. Oh, it's because I've spelled type wrong. Let's go back to that and say type. Save that and it'll rerun. There we are. We see type input file. It's chosen. It. Click submit. But as you can see, after we've submitted it, if we go to the after, you can see no, it's just gone to no file chosen. Even though it was, it's cleared it back down, which is exactly what the page does. If you go back to the start of the video, when I uploaded a file here and then click submit, it just went back to no file chosen. But, when, but Cypress is completely ignoring this alert that's appeared. You can see here that the alert has been there, file uploaded successfully, or file successfully uploaded but we haven't actually seen it on the page. So we want to assert that. And the way to do this is by using the scion method. So we can say sci.on, and then inside here, we want to say window alert. So whenever an alert appears, we want to catch the message inside this. We'll say message, do our callback here. And we want to say something like expect message to equal whatever it was. So in our case, let's mix it fail for now files. Let's save that, let's make it fail. You can see that we expected this file successfully uploaded, but we said files. So I haven't done this so I can take the text. So let's copy that and paste it here and save. And now then you can see we have our assertion that's happened here that said, okay, when there's a window alert, let's assert whatever the text in that mess that alert was that we can actually assert against this. So we are now confident that our file has been successfully uploaded and we've asserted against that. 
Perfect. And that's how we can perform file uploads in Cypress. If you do have any questions or comments, please drop them down below. A like and subscribe is appreciated. I've also enabled super thanks. If you do want to help contribute towards the running of this website and the videos I make, then you can do that. And as always, thanks for watching. Have a good day.